Hi, I'm Mike Elliott, and you're watching CEO Live TV. In this episode, we're joined again by Mr. Scott Poulter, who's heading up business development internationally for Pacific Green Technologies, ticker PGTK. PGTK has developed a patented portfolio of emissions control technologies for use in both power plant and marine applications. They have a veteran management team and a global footprint with offices in the U.S., Europe, and China, and they're rolling out one of the most competitive technologies to date to help large ships with Category 3 diesel engines, control emissions, and meet increasingly strict environmental regulations by 2020. Good afternoon, Scott. Welcome back. Hi, Mike. Good to see you again. How are you doing? I'm doing great. So you're doing well, obviously. Congratulations on today's announcement regarding Union Maritime Limited. Tell us what the agreement entails and what you'll be doing for them. Uh, the agreement entails um, two different classes of ships um, for us to provide scrubbers for. One is um, what's called an Ultramax, which is a bulk carrier. Uh, and the second are, um, are chemical tankers. Um, one lot, the chemical tankers are being produced currently in uh, Korea, South Korea, um, and the bulk carriers will be uh, uh, constructed in China. So we're working, we'll obviously um, work with the uh, union on the scheduling. They get they, they roll out over a period starting this fall uh, through to early 2020. And it's part of what we've been talking to union about, looking at the fleet, looking at We've been doing some metrics for them and working with their team on the economic benefits. And obviously, even since we've been talking on your CEO Live, we've seen the, um, the spread in the fuel diff quite considerably widen. Okay. And obviously, every time that widens, the return on the investment becomes a lot clean, cleaner, quicker, um, and consequently a lot more compelling for taking scrubbers as uh, the route to meet the 2020 legislation needs. And... How much does this help you guys going forward as you're talking to other fleet owners uh, now that you have one uh, that's actually hired you guys to do the retrofits? I mean, in, in terms of going forward and, and these future meetings you'll have with obviously with new fleet owners, this has to make it significantly easier, I would think. Yeah, I mean, obviously, there's a couple of things, you know, um, we um, we installed the uh, uh, hybrid system onto the Westminster, which is one of Union's chemical tankers last year. That system's been operating now for six months. You know, we've got quite a lot of data. Union obviously have a level of comfort in terms of operating the system, how it operates and the benefits of it. So when you put all that together, you know, they are a logical first um, client for us. Um, and and Laurent um, has been very, very, uh, the uh, managing director has been very supportive of PGT. Um, and, you know, it's been a really good advocate of what we're doing. So it's going to help us in a number of different ways. A, reputationally, you know, union have a very good uh, reputation in the marketplace. And secondly, also, you know, we, we see that um, other people will see that there's a benefit to looking at, you know, broad agreements across different classes within the same fleet owner. Um, and as a consequence, that's kind of the area of business we'll be targeting. And Scott, where will most of the manufacturing of, of the scrubbers take place? Um, pretty much all the, the fabrication is going to be done with our, um, through our joint venture with uh, Power China. Uh, Spam and we're going to be producing most of that in uh, um, Shanghai or in the local Chinese region. But consequently, some of it may well be done, uh, parts of it will be fabricated as locally needed for installations at different yards. I mean, under this agreement, we foresee most of the installation being done in Asia. However, for other vessels, um, either unions or other potential clients, um, we're looking at different uh, different yards around the world. And consequently, we're then looking at the logistics of the movement of the equipment, the movement of the fabrication, and what we need to do in a localized manner. Well, Scott, again, congratulations. This is huge news for PGTK, something that you've been building up to for years. It's uh, it's you know a good vote of confidence for the technology that it works now a major fleet owner has hired you guys to start retrofitting some of their brand new vessels so coming off the line so uh it looks like this will set the stage for for even bigger things to come for the remainder of 2018 that's all our questions for today anything else you want to tell investors before we close no Mike, i think you know as i say we're seeing imo being quite um resilient in terms of their position about 2020 so um we now know that's causing the the industry in total to now look at um, the options that are available to them for meeting the emissions regulations for um, the, um, 2020. We see with the fuel diff that's starting to spread wider, 
um, that consequently, you know, probably even during the period of time that we've been talking in the last six months, um, the return on investment time for scrubbers has probably been reduced by maybe 20 to 25%. Um, and as that continues to widen, we'll probably see that um, decrease even further still. So this is a, it's a good moment for us in terms of um, recognizing what's coming over the next period of time. That time window to 2020 and, 2000, you know, and onwards um, is make, uh, are in decisions making now um, and through the rest of 2008. So we anticipate this to be a very good year for us. As do I. Yeah, we've been following the story for a long time and it looks like everything's really coming together this year. So, um, you know, we'll continue to cover it here. Scott, again, a pleasure. Thanks for your time and we'll catch up with you again soon. Mike, pleasure to see you again and uh, look forward to speaking to you next time. Likewise, take care. You too, bye-bye. You've been watching CEO Live TV. We've been talking again to Mr. Scott Poulter, who heads up business development for Pacific Green Technologies, ticker PGTK. To learn more about them, please visit their website at www.pacificgreentechnologies.com. So thanks again for watching CEO Live TV.